held a listening session tonight on race and diversity. KCCI's Max Deaknight was there and Max City leaders heard some powerful stories. Yes, yeah, Steve, they did. The point of tonight was to give people the chance to be heard. They called for police reform and shared personal stories of being racially profiled in the city. That included the story of a biracial 16 year old who said she and her younger sister were profiled at a local store. We were shopping in the children's section at Target while a white security guard followed us around the entire time until we got back to our white mother and we're leaving the store. I mean, I don't do, I mean, do I look like a threat to any of you guys? I mean, I'm a 16 year old girl, what am I gonna do? Hit you with my purse? She got a round of applause when she was finished speaking, by the way. Al Womble, the chair of the Iowa Democratic Black Caucus, told the council he was disappointed more people of color weren't at tonight's forum, saying the council needs to do a better job with community outreach. He also said between the coronavirus and recent race riots, the mental health of students in the school district needs to be a top priority. We need to treat this just as seriously as we would treat Hurricane Katrina, wildfires, or earthquakes. In a few more months, we're going to ask young people to re-enter this building and interact with one another. Urbandale Mayor Bob Andewig said the city has created a website to follow up on tonight's session. There will be a summary on what was talked about tonight and also answers to people's questions. That website is on your screen. It's urbandale.org slash listen. Steve.